Good morning, guys. Starting this a lot later than planned because I've had a nightmare with my batteries this morning. All the ones I thought were charged when I put it on my case are absolutely not charged. So we are just going with the fact that this is where we're starting. We're currently walking through the airport and gone through security and everything. To be honest, not as bad as everyone's been saying it's going to be. It was really, really easy to get through everything and it just hasn't been busy at all. To go to America at the moment, all you need is a lateral flow before you leave, like the day before you leave. And that's it, so it's been very, very simple. And we're now gonna go for a bit of bougie shopping. Like, I'm planning to buy a designer bag, so is Lauren. Lauren's also thinking of getting some shoes slash sunglasses. Basically, we're gonna get a bit spinny. <laughs> An Air Force shopping trip is in order. So we're gonna find some food, find some designer bits, and I'll let you know what we get. and they have the bag that I want and she said there's literally one in stock. It was out the back, so I think I'm gonna do it. I think I'm gonna make the little spenny purchase. It is like a 30th birthday present to myself, but also like I've wanted a nice bag for a really long time and I've never spent like a lot on a bag, so I think it's time to just get a little bit spenny and treat myself for my 30th because this is the yes year of saying yes to everything and <sighs> exciting times. Also me and Lauren are gonna be twinning because she's currently using the bag and also deciding over a pair of Gucci trainers that she really wants, which we're probably gonna end up going and getting. I'm now that person that's like taking a million pictures of my new bag, because why would you not? It's just cost me a small fortune. But um, I'm gonna put a little picture on my feed, so if you haven't seen already, go give it a little like. But we've ended up at Wagamama's and we're gonna get some breakfast. I didn't realize Wagamama's even did breakfast, but they've got like granola bowls, avo toast, etc. So I'm gonna get some of that and like a nice little carrot cleanse juice or something to just give us some energy. She's sat here thinking gyoza. I'm gonna probably just get a normal Wagamama's. <laughs> That's so on. Just get like some ramen, get some gyoza, and then we're gonna get Itsu for the plane as well because then we've got food, because our flight's throughout the day. We're not really gonna sleep and then when we get there we're gonna go into straight like just travel mode and just do stuff rather than going back to the hotel so we need a good feeding before we go and i've downloaded all my euphoria so we're just watching it on the plane too just got off the plane and basically <laughs> lauren <laughs> Lauren can't remember how to open the boot, but we've just got to our car. So we've got a little convertible Mustang for the week. Very exciting, very bougie. Can't wait to just get the roof down and live the like the hills moment driving with the roof down, listening to cheesy music. But we had a bit of a chaotic end, like getting out of the airport because there was a lot of people and we couldn't work out where to go and it was a bit of a mess. So we basically just got here and I thought I'm not gonna vlog anything because I've been trying to lug all of this around. So, my God, how are we gonna fit anything in I told in there? you, that's why I said we need to get a Jeep. I, told I didn't realise how small this is, but yeah, we're going to make it work. It'll be fine. That is just a very small boot. I don't think you can grasp how small it is. Like, it'll fit some of our small ones in. Rain on your skin, no one else can feel it for you. Only you can get it. Okay, we're gonna just ignore the state of my hair. We've had the roof off, but we've just got to Venice Beach and we're gonna go and have a little look around and just like walk along see what's here chill lauren's been before so she's kind of like just telling me what's what and we're going to where are we gonna look at abbott kinney abbott kinney we're gonna go maybe get a coffee and then we're gonna try and find something to eat as well because we're technically on uk time still and it's like one in the morning now but it's actually only like six is it six well 20 to six in the afternoon so we need something to eat because i'm starving and our energy's starting to like lag a little bit but we're trying to pick it back up and we're trying to get like back in the mojo
just got to our hotel and oh my goodness the car ride here was like 40 minutes and i nearly fell asleep i am so tired you see me in the mirror <laughs> but this is our hotel so we're staying at the lion hotel which is in Koreatown, um which is like not too far from anything to be honest it's kind of like a good location according to lauren i don't actually know this for a fact i'm going to give you a quick like overview of the room i'm not going to do a full tour because our cases are in here and there's not much room to root to move around cases so this is what it looks like okay so we've got a little bathroom in here just a little standard typical bathroom then there's like the wardrobe bits here but then you've got obviously a little seating area very cute with a little picture tv's up there bed is here and it kind of looks out onto the view which lauren's going to try and work out how to get that up in a minute and then you've actually got a little desk here as well so it's quite a cool little room if i put it on wide angle you can kind of see it's a very very cool little room and i like the fact the bed is like facing the window i think it's quite cool i think we might be back on the camera now all the batteries are charged i hope fingers crossed the charger is playing up but good morning guys welcome to the first day in la the first like full proper day this morning we've had like a chaotic unpacking sorting situ and we're heading out to a couple of meetings and stuff and we're also going to try and get loads of bits done today because we're only in la for two more days or two more full days and then we're heading over to palm springs for the rest of the time here so it's a bit of a busy one and we're just trying to like make sure we get as much done as possible and like see all the things so today we're heading over to like beverly hills way and we're gonna go to a couple of appointments because lauren's got a couple this morning then we're gonna head for brunch we're gonna get some bits done maybe go to santa monica later she's running around like a crazy person behind me and we're just gonna like get loads of stuff done so it's not going to be like a full la lowdown we're not going to be doing like the most things in the world but we're going to minimize and do like all the little things and then naturally we're probably going to be back in a few months time because we've said we want to come back and do like a non-worky trip so we've got like just time to enjoy la rather than doing all the showrooms and like coachella and everything as well yeah exciting gonna head out the door now this is my little outfit so i've just got a little monkey vest on here i've got these which are h&m i've got my vans on i'm gonna put an oversized blazer and then i've just got these astrid Amu necklaces which are really gorgeous i actually love this i'm not really i'm not normally a color person but i really liked the little multicolored beads oh i am also using the new child she's coming on her first outing today she's coming with me outfit just changed slightly so i've got this little shirt on which is h&m and then these little shorts which is a fourth and reckless very cute they're actually sale ones they're not available anymore i don't think um and then i've just got my docks on my feet and my little new bag down there so we've popped into the asc global showroom just to see a few bits pull some bits for coachella and just have a little look around and there's so much cute stuff at the moment so we picked up a few little bits which i'll show you in a minute and um pulled some bits for coachella like see what we've got see what it looks good and just try and create some cool outfits when we're in palm springs because obviously coachella is like a whole fashion vibe isn't it so we wanted to get some really good bits but yeah just having a little cheeky glass of wine first wines of the trip and enjoying ourselves little haul of goodies to take home with us including a gorgeous lack of colours hat which I'll put a picture on the screen of what it looks like it's so beautiful I'm obsessed with this um, we're just having a cheeky little wine and the showroom is just in here but how cool is this it's in like a little villa and there's a just beautiful little pool outside it's so nice We've come down to Malibu Pier and oh my god it's stunning like I don't know if you can see this behind me but oh, it's so pretty so at the end of the pier as you can see we are at the end of the pier there's a little like viewing platform and it's just so pretty like it's stunning and I am literally so grateful to be here like genuinely thank you 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 Like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door oh, You don't have to wake up yet Bought some salt water taffy to try when I get home As I said, we've come to Malibu Pier and we've come to Malibu Farm for dinner and oh my god, there is so much food but it looks so good. Neither of us have really eaten anything today so we've <laughs> we've ordered up and there is so much on the table. So we've got like tofu tacos, Lauren's got like a trio of tacos. So yours is like a veggie one, a chicken one and a beef one, isn't it? I think. Nachos, we've got hummus, 
There's a lot of food and it's very, very colourful and I'm here for it. <laughs> your favorite music on all the way baritone oh, yeah. shut the lights go in front of We've ended up on Santa Monica here and we're gonna go on some rides and stuff because why not? Um, it's freezing, I'm not gonna lie, it's so cold. Um, <laughs> it's so cold, but we've got to do it. We're here, we're gonna have some fun and get some games going. Good morning guys, it's 6 a.m. and we are running out the door because we're gonna go and try and hike in Runyon Canyon and see the Hollywood sign and stuff. But oh my god, it is early and this is my outfit, a little like Leopard, leopard. I've got a leotard underneath, hair's up, hat's going on in the car, got all our stuff, got our cake. I get the wine and the corkscrew. You don't have to do one single thing. We just had quite the parking experience. Um, we tried to park in a spot that we could be towed, and as we stopped, a uh, man that was walking his dog had to basically help us in how to go to somewhere where we wouldn't be towed. So sometimes on the signs they've got like an arrow pointing left and he said as long as you're like behind the arrow you're fine. Um, so he gave us a little hand and helped us with where to park and he's told us where to hike for the best views. So me and Lauren are currently just hiking down now. Um, the sun is already up. We were planning to do a sunrise but it's just not, there's not really a parking here, like it's blocked off, so you do have to street park. So that's one thing to be mindful of. Like if you're planning to come here, don't bring your car. Like it's probably better to Uber, um, but it's so beautiful. It just looks all like hazy. You know when you get like that haze that kind of looks like, like a, uh, what's it called, like a painting? It looks a bit like that, um, but it's beautiful. And yeah, he's told us where to go. So apparently when you come in, you go through the big gate and then you just walk and then you do a sharp right and then you can loop back on yourself. So that's what we're doing. He told us we don't have appropriate so where to do the other hikes. So <laughs> this is what we're doing. Just looking at you makes my whole world spin. Not gonna lie, when I say hike, it really is a hike. <laughs> you go down quite a steep bit that you have to come back up. It's quite steep. But it is really beautiful and I do recommend because you can see the Hollywood sign. It's not like the closest thing ever, but you can see it. It's a really cool little viewing spot. Oh, bad breath. Um, and I highly recommend coming at this time of day as well because it's nice and quiet. And it's also just a really beautiful time of day. We've got back from our hike. We have grabbed an Alfred's from downstairs, which is so good. I always get decaf almond latte. If you know me, you know that's my order every single time without fail. But I got a shot of ca um, cappuccino, <laughs> a shot of caramel in there and it tastes so good. But we've just popped a little outfit change. So I'm just wearing this feeler. Hang on, let me put my coffee down. It's probably the best way to do this. I've got a little feeler t-shirt, which is actually a men's one from Urban Outfitters, and I'm wearing a large. And then I've got these little shorts, which are fourth and reckless. They are sold out because they were in the sale. I've got them for quite cheap. I think they're like 13 pounds, but um, I'll leave them linked anyway, because I know they had a couple of sizes. And then I will also leave some similar ones down in the description box, because you never know, you might find some good ones. I have got mascara all over my eyeballs. If anyone knows a good um, way to not make this happen, let me know, because it happens all the time. Like very, I mean, it's like not a first world problem, but it's like a ugh, problem. My eyelashes are really long, so they always end up getting like here, which is so annoying. Like, you can see it all in my eyebrow, but there's nothing I can actually do about it. It happens 24 seven. We've packed all our stuff up. We've just got to close the cases and then we're going to get ready to head over to Palm Springs. We've got a long drive. We're going to stop for an in and out Well, we're going to try and stop for an in and out if not something else. We're going to find food en route because we've not eaten yet. We've just had the coffee. We also bought, where's the other drinks? We got ginger juice and water and the order came to like £30. Yesterday, we got like ginger juice, water, coffee. Lauren got like a little lychee sparkling water. Um, we got a cookie and like some other bits and it came to like 70 pounds. So it's expensive. Well, $70, but either way, it's fine. So yeah, just gonna, oh, I'm just gonna chill here for a little bit and enjoy this view for the last time because I'm gonna miss it. It's quite a cute little view to have. 